it's 7 and 4 pm and we have a dead bird. A dead bird on the road. We've just got the wings, the rest has been uh, eaten away. Don't go near that max now. That's not very nice, is it? Oh my god, that's made me feel sick. It's crossing over. It's getting off the Feeling a little unsteady on my feet. <sighs> That's actually made me feel quite ill. Let's let Max fade back a bit. Stay back a bit. I've been texting somebody before I've come out. So I was texting somebody before I came out. And this is what happens. So I'm texting someone right this minute on my phone. I haven't been wearing my cap. Been wearing my hair up. Normally, I put my cap on. I'm just trying to keep hold of my dog. As you can see, that was a bird in the road, and it's been either crushed to death and run over. So, keep an eye on Max, that's the main thing. Isn't it? Uh, my mother's just rung, so let's hear what my mum said. I've just come out of my flat. <sighs> let's hear what she said. I bet she's called me Janestra. Welcome to your EE voicemail. You have three new messages and two saved messages. First new message received today at 8.37 a.m. Hello, Janestra. It's me, your mum, Janice. I'm speaking to you from my landline phone, giving you a usual daytime telephone call. Hope you're okay. If you want to give me a minute. Message deleted. Next new message. Received today at 8.42 a.m. Hello, Janice, it's me again. Just to let you know, I haven't forgotten your dad. Okay, okay, Janice, I do understand how you feel because I feel on the train today about Derek. Okay, bye for now. Thinking of you. To listen to the message again, press 1. To save the message, press 2. To delete the message, press 3. To receive, your message will be saved for 7 days died 
and 25th of August 2021, and these wives have been for 54 years when you passed away, would know that. So I do realise how you feel and how I feel. All right, Janesta, thinking of you, bye. Right, so that is my mother Jennifer's phone call. Um, I've been talking to someone, uh, but via iPhone. So they must have an iPhone because they're messaging me through their iPhone. Right, so she's just called and we had a conversation. I said a few things and this is me coming outside after I've said personal things to someone over the phone. Very personal. Okay. So I hope there's no need to call the police. I said I hope there's no need to call the police, but we'll see. So let, let's go this way, let's go this way, there's dogs everywhere, it's been quiet for months. It's been quiet for months and months and months and now it's got noisy. So... I told you I'm trying to catch who's doing this to me. I'm trying to catch who's doing it. So I'm supposed to be talking to somebody on a mobile phone by text message, right? Stay there, Max. I'm going to get run over, do we? So I'm talking to this guy who's telling me he's called James. Okay, on this iPhone here. So I'm trying to do two things at once. They're telling me they're a man I'm speaking to, right? So we know that someone's, someone's taking the piss, right? They're taking the mickey. I'm, I'm not scared of anyone. I'm not scared of anyone. People can laugh at me, take the piss. I don't give a fuck. Don't bother me. I don't care. If someone wants to take the piss out of me, they're quite welcome. <laughs> so my son has told me to go and get some like photocopies from the library. I didn't have my camera in Rochester, but I've got it now. I've got it now, so you can hear all the noises and what goes on. bicycle coming down the path so just keep Max safe away from the bike I don't ride a bicycle never learnt to, to ride one <coughs> did you like the Manchester United cap I've got the pink Manchester United cap. <laughs> that came from Bernardo's. That cost me five pounds. The cost of living's gone up. Everything in charity shops has gone up. hair is red at the moment, red, it's not black, it's red. So, I can't
can't stand bullies, they make me feel sick. They always have to go around in three or fours or more because they can't deal with a person on their own. <sighs> Do you know, I've never had a bicycle. Never. <laughs> Not as an adult, no. I think I... Uh, my... <laughs> Do you know stabilizers? Terrible sense of balance. I can't ride a bicycle. Come on this way. This way. See if I've had any text messages since I've been outside. <laughs> Let me just answer this person. This is supposed to be James. Right, let's go this way. Let's go this way. Let's go this way. I've never ridden a bike and my hair isn't bald either. I don't know who they've mixed me up with but it's a joke. It's def look, I, ca I can show you, I can actually prove that someone is intercepting my messages. I can prove it. Because <laughs> whatever I'm saying, right, on this text messages to this person is happening outside right now. <laughs> and they will get caught. <laughs> I don't know if I can give you an instance. Somebody has sent me a picture of balloons from Balloon Ace. Balloon Ace. My hair is red, right? It ain't black. So on these balloons, there's a really young woman in what, what looks like a short top and a pair of very very short shorts and I'm 54 I'm 54 and I'm a woman and I just I got a bit pissed off to be honest a scantily clad woman on a balloon I got pissed off I've not had the best of days I've had a shitty fucking day and I'm pissed off 
We've got a large lady over there with black hair walking with her mates. And she's got a white t-shirt on like I had on this morning. I don't know what else I can prove. But I know for one thing for certain, Brian Harvey is not mad. He's not mad at all. He's not. Prove it. It's a good boy. Someone's intercepting my messages. I'm not, I'm not blaming the person sending me the messages. I don't think it's them, but I think someone else is reading her. You can see what I've put, can't you? I like the white one. What does it say? Nice black, long black hair, sex cells, of course, it's balloon ace. Do I stop talking to this person? Do I stop talking to them? Because every time I talk to this person, it gets really busy out here. You've seen my videos. It's been quiet for months. Then this person starts texting me on the phone. And it starts getting really, really busy. I don't know what dogs he had. He put a couple of car, uh, dogs in the back of his back of his car. Charlie's girlfriend has got long dark hair with grey bits in it. That bloke that walked around this field with me. She doesn't come out very much. She doesn't get out of the flat very much. She's his, his girlfriend. They're not together. She's his friend. And she don't get out very much. No, I haven't changed into somebody else. It's still me. I don't even know. Well, who, who am I speaking to? Their phone's broken. It's broken. They can't show me their face because their phone's not working. I know who used to have a profile picture of a dog on his WhatsApp. The guy I met off YouTube used to have a profile picture of a dog. I hope it isn't him. the guy came from Maidstone I'm not sure now Maidstone 
lot younger than me as well. Some men like mother figures, don't they? They like an older woman because they want the woman to, to, to look after them like a baby. <laughs> and pay for their stuff. Some men do. They want to be treated like a baby. <laughs> right, guys, I'm going to cut off here, but... I don't know what the fuck is going on. It goes from being really, really quiet to being really, really busy after I'm talking to someone on the phone. No idea. See you later.